Either way, hey guys, welcome to the stream. So yeah, welcome to the stream. It's just gonna be Xenoblade side quests and such. be a long stream. Okay. So yeah, this won't be a long stream. Crafting best to do with friend helping out. Talk to guy over there. You know all about it. Oh, an ultra small reactor. Well, I never. Now I can make you that mobile furnace. Mobile furnace. Hand it over. I'll fix it up in a jiffy. All right, just put that in there. Whoopsie daisy. Oh, slide that there. That's not right. That goes here. Almost got it. Ta-da! All done. This mass-producing reactor is no longer a fanciful dream. And I'm gonna let you have it. Now you can craft gems whenever you want. Although I won't mind if you still come around just to chat. Yeah, that won't lead, lead us anywhere. My brother's home. I I don't believe it. There's no question. This is my son's armor, gun, and knife. He saved so up so hard to buy them. I remember how he smiled when he changed into his new armor. I've no choice but to accept it. Nothing will bring my son back. But at least some part of him has returned to the place he grew up. For that. I am very grateful. I'm glad everything worked out. All done! Well done, us! On behalf of both my son and myself, thank you very much. Yes. Now. <sighs> Maybe. Damn it. I completely forgot. Eddie, I wanted to keep it as a surprise for you. I thought you weren't paying attention, so you wouldn't know. Good work. I'll take him under my wing and make him to the best sky artist. Go and tell Jackson for me. Tell him your heart is boundless like the very sky itself.
I'm going to become Kenny Rohan, student. He'll mold me into the greatest guy artist. That sounds amazing. Wow, now my hobby is going to be my job. Hey, Sam, I'm streaming. It don't get much better than that. I'm glad everything worked out. Excellent job, Shulk. You're really growing up fast. Really? That means a lot coming from you. I won't let you down. <laughs> I'm glad I asked you to take care of this. Here's a little something to say thanks. Hey, you're just in time. I need your help with the job. Could you go into more detail? But, but Riki thought Shulk know everything about everything. Not this time, Riki. We'll just have to listen. I think my teacher will give me a reward, but you can have it. It's pretty easy, really. There's a strange bug that's been bothering people around here. I can't see it anywhere near here right now, though. Anyway, my teacher doesn't want it interfering with his work. That's why he asked me to get rid of it. I think the bug was last seen around Kneecap Hill. That's on the other side of Tefra Cave. Fancy doing a bit of pest control? Yes. Thanks. It's called Dim Wisp. It's a nasty one, so you'd better be careful. No problem. Leave it to me. Yes, I too will give it my all. Yeah, I just need to get bunny a bunny a scent wood from your sofa bococo.
Yeah, it looks like Dunban learned a new skill. <laughs> Thank you, Piotr. I appreciate it. Yep. Hello, Piotr. Yeah, we need to trade with Russia.
first we got... That's not what we were supposed to do. I need to search for a place that know more about medicine. There are, I wish there was a place where home home and bird people live. Do friends know a place like that? Norara would go anywhere for her friend. Can home home make shiny light, light like bird people can? Once you see that shiny light, you never forget it. It's so mesmerizing. Around and around we go. There's good reason why this place is so open. It is because Terex and Lakelet gather here before battle. Me? You say me have big hands? No, 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 these are not hands. These are wings, most charming no pawn parts. Okay, that was... That was weird, cause, 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 yeah, charming parts. People would be talking about different parts of the body. Be careful of this bad nopon here. He can get a bit bitey sometimes. Dearie, dearie, what brings you home, home to Frontier Village anyway? There's a type of food called albatro that you get in Magna. What? Albatro is a monster? Me was just about to go eat some. If other Nopon make the same mistake, it could be fatal. Me could have gone to eat it and ended up getting eaten myself. Do something about it. Yeah, just have to practice my glottal stops for a more authentic British accent. again. Do you know big bugs and magna love flowers? 
yes, thank you so much. I I do it. It's it keeps me more engaged and also it's like really it really helps like viewers that can't really see the action. So yeah. Thanks for the compliment. If you like what you see, drop a follow. I'm trying to get to Affluent. I'm going to be honest here. And every follow counts. Do you know big bugs in Machno love flowers? They make weird buzzing noises. Give me creeps. Okay, that was not the right way to go, apparently. Yeah, this part is quite screwy. But we'll get through it. I don't know why they have to make a freaking tree so hard to climb. I now feel like an idiot. Me training to become warrior, but it really, really tough. Me here at best to eat tangy food when tired from training. In that case, me want to eat some really tangy pure cherries. Just thinking, thinking about pure cherries make me my mouth water. Bring me back some before Magna drowns in my drool. Well, that's done. day. Magna right as rain. Hom Hom coming to village is only thing that different from yesterday. Thanks for the follow, Jason. I really appreciate it. I'm trying to make a heart with my hands, but it's really hard to see. The lighting in here isn't the best. But yeah, this is me. Hi, guys. That's Turtwig back there. No, he has- oh wait, he has a name. It's Lemmy. I can't not name Lemmy. I'm sorry for calling you just Turtwig, Lemmy. Okay, so we have to go down to the previous floor. Yes. Peppa Pig? What Peppa's favorite thing in the whole wide world? Could you go into more detail? But Ricky thought Shulk know everything about everything. Not this time, Ricky. We'll just have to listen. 
Well, it can be glittery, squidgy, spongy, shiny, or fluffy. But as long as it's cute, it will be Peppa's favorite thing. Peppa love all cute things. Peppa want to be surrounded by cute things as long as she lives. Peppa have so many cute things, they coming out of Peppa's ears. Why Peppa collect so many cute things? If Peppa's surrounded by cute things, she become cutest thing on Bionis. You're pretty damn close to it, <laughs> I must say. Ricky not understand cute things if cute smack him in face. Ricky is here upon that all Rick, Ricky need to understand. And then there's Peppa. She's dead. Cute things for little pawn. Meh. Ricky only become hero pawn, so others stop calling him little pawn. Anyway, it's job of no pawn girls to collect cute things. More cute means more chance of finding Prince. Friends understand Peppa's reason for liking cute things. Thank you. Now friends can go look for cute things for Peppa. Peppa want Enigma lotuses, happy rabbits, and love cranes. No problem. Leave it to me. Hero Pond show you what he can do. Okay. I was doing the right thing before. Ricky, great machine. Is it all made from wood? Tut tut tut, shock say wrong word. This not machine. Because it's not made of metal. Yay, shock right. Machine has metal. No pond device use no metal, so not called machine. Now that I think, I haven't noticed a lot of metal in the village. Ricky and Nopon at one with the forest. If forest not have metal, Nopon not use metal. That's very resourceful of you. Long, long time ago, Nopon make many, many things. I'm impressed. I'd love to know more about these pollen orbs, too. They light up and produce heat, but they never burn up. Yellow and blue herbs are safe to eat, but red one, not so safe. I saw a red one by the lift. It looked tasty enough. Shulk want to eat red one. Ricky not like red ones. Ricky's stomach go thump thump, then squeal squeal. If Shulk eat and finish whole red one, Ricky give Shulk metal. Sounds like a challenge to me. Ricky no need red orb anyway. I can make yummy food for Ricky. Is that what makes you so bouncy? Maybe I need to eat more orbs. Okay, we need to go down a level. to give flower bracelet to girlfriend, but it get eaten by Terex. It probably passed safe 
safely through gut of Terex in one piece. You sure about that? Digestive acid is pretty, um, acidic. Must be lying somewhere near. Friends, please search for it. Of course, we clean it up before I give it to girlfriend. Friends look disgusted, or maybe me just imagine it. Well, we did that. Want to make her some sparkly clothes as a present. Apis gold nuggets perfect to represent long life. Want friends to go get me some. Of course. Can friends do this task? Me prepare cloth and wait for friends here. Mushrooms in village. They are in bad shape though, not telling time properly. That doesn't sound good. True, but I'm sure you can find a solution, Shulk. You're right, Dunban. I'm sure we'll work it out. Everyone in spot of bother, as we do not know when it is snack time. As you can see, I am not as young as was when I was young. I mean, that's kind of a given. I do not wish to climb those steps. Can friends make repairs for us? Time mushrooms are on first, fourth, and seventh floors. They are constantly releasing spores. You will know which ones I mean. No problem. Leave it to me. Very good, Shulk. Let's get this sorted out. Yeah! Put this on them. It is fertilizer. It will fix them instantly. Thank you. At this time of year, a lot of Magna Eluca migrate to this area. My niece Pon is scared of bugs. Could I ask you to do some pest control? That doesn't sound good. True, but I'm sure you can find a solution, Shulk. You're right, Dunban. I'm sure we'll work it out. I would do it myself, but I'd get the thrashing of my life. Well, I mean, I've, I read the spoilers. Like, is it in this game? Or is it like... Or is it Xenoblade 2 or any or or is it Xenosaga or Xenogears? But if it's a certain spoiler character, don't worry. I've seen her. I I know she joins the I know they joined the party. Okay then. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I guess we'll see him when we do that. I would do it myself, but I get the thrashing of my life. I can't hold a weapon properly because of an old injury. And of course, everyone has that allergy really bad this year. My head is all bummed up. Hmm, you look in very good shape. Have you been working out? Ah, that's very kind of you to notice. Thank you. But I cannot use my own properly. Not even for everyday work. So you're a lot like Dunban then. So, can you get rid of the Magna Alucas for me? Of course. Thank you. Would you mind them telling Cherry that you got rid of them? No problem. Leave it to me. If Joke put a 
his mind to it. Ricky, no, he succeeds. I'm relying on you too, Ricky. Doesn't sound good. Ah, that's terrible. So terrible. Pipiki here goes every night. Pipiki's so scared. Pipiki don't sleep a week for days now. Pipiki hear voice of ghosts from under house. Pipiki don't think it's inside. Must be coming from below. No problem. Leave it to me. Very good, Shulk. Let's get this sorted out. Yeah. I think we just have to go up from here. Go buy in from many different places. Very hard work, but Puka is up to the job. It looks in bad shape. I'll, I'll give it some compost. Looks like this time mushroom is working properly. Where'd Rasha go? Rasha. Because Rasha's the one I have to trade with, right? No, that's not the way to get to Rasha. That's not even Rasha. Hey, 
Russia is. So long, Gay Bowser. Yeah, next stop will be Alchemon. Friends bring stinky thing. Gift or rubber rubber. Give, give, give. Pay you. Smell worse than imagine. That's perfect. Thank you, hum hum people. to Nello. But Nello has bad influence on Little Pond. He should drink less. Yes. Because of you, Baroba run outside like a good no pond. Big thank you. This only little, but please take it. I'm glad everything worked out. Right, it was well worth the effort. I see Baroba's happy face again. All thanks to you, only possible because you helped. Really, thank you. Passed out, Keelan helped Nello. Nello must thank him sometime. Nello still be lying there otherwise.
Okay, this one is done. Creates a housing level. Hello, new viewers. Welcome to Xenoblade, where we will be playing um, Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition for the Nintendo Switch family of systems. Today is just basically a side quest day. Okay, our next thing will be the commerce. I want to do commerce, n nature, and special. How's it going? You really ask around. Thank you. It'll come in handy, I'm sure. I'm glad everything worked out. Let me see. So I should pick myself up, give her presents, and give compliments as well. Yeah, yeah, got it. Thanks. Now I just have to find the confidence to put it to use. Matriona, here I come. How's it going? The advice you collected for me was perfect for writing my book. I have been sweat, sweat and blood and tears to finish it for Matriona. The book has to tell her everything I feel for her. But I'm worried about whether, whether, whether it'll make her understand my feelings. Could you go into more details? You can speak freely. Shulk is a very good listener. Melia, I wouldn't go that far. She won't, will she? I said I was ready, but I just can't find the courage to hand it to her. That's why I decided to go on a trip to find some courage. A life changing field trip but no prince zuko because this is an avatar's xenoblade thank you friends my destiny is my own now i can count on your support if things get rough out there right now i must decide whether to go to the ether mine or saturo marsh if i find myself in a pickle you'll come help me right Thanks, I appreciate it. Where's Olga? There's Olga. Uh, as much as I love Gower playing during the day, the night version is pretty, like, nice and chill to listen to. Still doesn't beat the day one, though. Oh, Garuka sent a reply for Daza. Thank you, friends. Daza interested in red things. Daza asked Garuka to investigate some things. 
But Garoko not find conclusive evidence, so he's still working. Thank you for helping, Daza. I'm glad everything worked out. Friends take this top secret data. They become useful. Yeah, I'm trying 100% the items, because that's how I am. I'm that kind of player. It's not my fault I like 100%ing stuff, except stuff that, like, just drags out. It's our next, next spot in our... Wild Ride is Magda Forest. Yes. Need to find hoed planks as well. For a couple of different, completely different quests. I have to find them for the bridge and the bridge that connects Sword Valley to here. And no, is it? It's Sword Valley, or it's Valak Mountain, or yeah, it's something with a V. Okay, so we have to go up here. Honestly, if I play too much Xenoblade, I hope people won't st start thinking I'm British. That's the worst possible scenario. Careful I've had to be in this game. Melia, you're... Melia, you're a high Hyentia. Can't you just fly back up there? <laughs> yes, I know her wings are vestigial. Because she's not a Telethia anymore. Well, no. Okay. Melia was never a Telethia in the first place. But her species is not the Telethia anymore. That's what I'm trying to say. God damn it. You never, sometimes you can't win. 
But you know what happens? When you don't win, you try again. Until you win. Or you can just cut your losses. But today's not going to be a cut my losses type of day. This happens again. Yeah, the thing about Xenoblade is like you have to be really cautious with your movement. Kind of makes the game more fun. This is me trying to be careful. Well, at least we made it there. Gotta, gotta do it one more time. We're, we're done here. We never have to do this again. Yeah, if, if there's one thing you've got to know about me, I'm really impatient and I'm a sucker for instant gratification. So stuff like this where you have to move slow and stealth missions, not for me! Okay, this this bullshit's all over. Goodbye. Now let's proceed to the next area, I guess. I love the little sound effect changes. This game is something special. Juicy. Okay, now through this tunnel, we'll find something to finish a quest. Another collectible? And another one? Ah, the Divine Sanctuary. This has to be the place that Satata was talking about. I'll throw on the cap, as you said. 
May you rest in peace. Rest in peace indeed, good friend. Even though you don't really exist, your loss is felt. Just an Arbuka. A John Boyce hold. Speaking of John Boyce, I am just so ready for um to Steve Steve documentary. Like I love History of the Mariners. I loved History of the Falcons. I love basically anything this that man puts his puts his, like, hands upon. Because he's great. The There's another Hode. Fun fact, Hoda is German for balls. Well, I mean one ball. Ho the balls is Hoden. Honestly, let's get Riki in the party so he can, if there's any more materials, you know what, screw that. I'm going to play as Riki himself. The inner machinations of my mind are an enigma. Like, yeah, I mostly just play with Shulk because I'm like, oh, he's a protagonist. Let's just play as him all the time. He said the line.
Look at Ricky. Yeah, I'm playing with Riki until he levels up. I love this game. He said the line. So yeah, we're going to need eight eight hold planks. And we're dead. Bye, Josh. Five fancy or Luga masks.
freaky leveled up. Nothing special, just sweaty cloths. There's four. So we're halfway there. Let's have the Dunbam fangirl play as Dunbam for once in her life. Three more. Okay, we need 
We need two more. Two more hold planks. Our guy. This place looks infested. Okay.
I have no idea when Pile Hoods are supposed to like spawn. I, I'm just assuming that they can spawn at all times. Well, we got another one. We need one more. Send the line. Okay, so now we have all of you. not the right bridge quest. Oh wait, we have to do the Rogal ask axes. So yeah, back to Colony 6, where we will we'll level up the commerce and end the stream there. our commerce upgrade. Hi, Eddie. Well, sadly, we're we're about to finish up. <laughs> I'm sorry I had to be streaming at an inconvenient time. Take this place over the camp any day of the week. It's lovely. I'll forever be grateful for a nice warm bed. If I'm being honest, I wish we had two restaurants competing with each other. They'd fight for customers and the food would be keep getting better. And I could eat delicious food every day. It would be so nice. Hashtag capitalism, am I right?
Yes, please. If you throw... Every follow you give me means less money going to the platform of Twitch and more money going to me. So yeah, if you follow me, you are literally giving me money. Okay, it's probably like pennies on the dollar, but it's money. I need money. Gotta make a living somehow. I know it's not good optics to be begging for followers, but yeah. I can literally be, be paid for doing this. People actually want to watch people do this. Roll through menus. And sell things. This is profitable somehow. So yeah, I hope all you guys enjoyed the stream, which I did. I don't know if I'm going to, like, be streaming this weekend, but I'll be back, like, if it is. Because we might be, like, streaming Mario Party or Mario Kart or Mario something or whatever. But... Or maybe even Pikmin. I, I don't know. But yeah. I hope you all enjoyed the stream. See you later, alligators.